Hey guys, welcome back to Simple Cyclist. Today I'm diving into part one of what we are going to be calling Simple Foundations. So this is going to be a multi-week series. Going to link it in the series description below. We're going to dive into Simple Cyclist, talk about some meanings and try and set up a bit of a foundation for you to take, start taking this philosophy into your bike riding. So lesson number one, today's episode, we are talking about a cyclist definition of simple. When I first started looking into the definition of simple, I came across a couple of different variations and I wanted to dive into that today so we can start to pinpoint a little bit about what when we talk about simple cyclists, what we mean by that here on this channel. Definition of simple on dictionary.com, got it here. Simple describes something that is easy to understand or do as being plain or not elaborate, or as being ordinary or common. Let's break that down a little bit. First, let's be honest, cycling is not an easy thing to do. It's hard. The saying goes, it doesn't get any easier, you just go faster. And that's true, no matter what stage of cycling you're at, it hurts. You've got to push the pedals, you've got to put the effort in. Now that might mean a different speed for everyone and you're pushing your own goals, but it's never easy. It's always difficult. Also, it's not plain and it's quite elaborate a lot of the times. You know, I often would say to people that cycling's a 90% image sport. It's extremely elaborate. We, we, we try and portray this um, in our riding. We try and portray our style and our personality. It's often why we really like the sport. So it's far from plain. And let's be honest. You do not want someone to consider you ordinary if you're a cyclist. We train really hard, we work really hard to, so that almost to other people, if they say we're ordinary, we'd be quite offended. So what on earth are we doing here? Putting simple and cyclist together in the same, in the same phrase, in the same sort of place. Because really simple and cycling just do not go together. Really it comes down to that first part of that definition. And when we talk about simple here at Simple Cyclist, we're talking about this. We want cycling to be simple to understand. And when we say understand, it's about understanding it for you. It's about understanding it for yourself. Because cycling is elaborate, it's complex, it's hard, it's not ordinary. But when we start to understand simple for ourselves with our bike riding, we start to really unlock the purpose of the sport in our lives. So simple does not mean easy. Simple means understood, and that's where we want to go. Lesson number one, simple means understood. So with that said, we're going to talk about three areas in our cycling journey that we need understanding to help make cycling simpler. First up, practical understanding. This is everything from what bike do I ride, what gear do I ride, what tires do I use, anything practical to do with this sport. Obviously a huge area to cover no matter what area of cycling you want to focus in on, there's so many different things we need to understand in that regard. But understanding it will allow us to choose better and allow us to have better uh, experiences based on equipment and choices and allow us to have more fun more often on our bikes from a practical sense. Second, we're going to talk about physical understanding of the sport. Obviously, we're the engine. We've got to put fuel in it. We've got to tune the engine, we've got to get the most out of it. If you've got big goals, big event goals, this is crucial to understand how to train, how to look after the body, how to get bodies through big rides or mini rides, whatever it is you're trying to achieve, we need to understand ourselves, our bodies, what we're capable of and how to push it further from a very physiological place. So we'll be talking about that as well in a bunch of upcoming videos. And third and probably most importantly, there's an emotional understanding to the sport. I think this sport can really give us so many different avenues to express ourselves, to have safe places to, to chat with people, to push boundaries, to show that we're capable of more, to helping us deal with the day-to-day -day things in life and to create a bit of a focal point. Nothing better than what cycling can do from our emotional state, our mental health, you know, things like that. So, we definitely want to be diving into how we can understand that part of cycling and how that affects us as human beings and how it helps us get through life and be a better person through the sport. Something I really am excited to talk more and more about 
and not only this series but ongoing be a big focus of this channel so to conclude guys i'm really excited about what we're going to be chatting about over this simple foundation series remember simple does not mean easy simple means understood and that's a big big focus i really hope that you guys can take a hold of that Hope you guys are starting to ask some questions of yourself and your bike riding. So if you want to see more of what's coming up, hit the subscribe button below. Really keen for people to, to come along on this series. If you're watching it as it comes out, wait till next week for the next one. If you're finding this for the first time at a later date, there'll be a series link below. Click on that, watch through them all, and start applying these questions to your riding and let's slowly start to create that space for ourselves where we can truly get the most out of the sport with understanding of all of these different areas. Thanks for coming along. We'll see you next week. Cheers.